So now I'm going to show you what happens when they are about to have their babies very soon. So there's her nest and she takes out her fur like I told you guys and then she puts it in her nest. So there's all her fur right there and in the back on the corner and then she like they act very restless and nervous. Hi, baby. Hi. So she's the mom. And she should be having her probably tonight because in the past 20 minutes she's been taking out her hair a lot. And it's pretty exciting because imagine just little baby bunnies taking care of them. And... I had my bunny since they're like a month and a half or a month maybe and they, they were so cute and tiny and now I get to have them again but they're daughters so she's taking out her fur right now again <laughs> excuse me there's like fur right there right there and there's like a little piece right there and it's like going everywhere, but um. So the the person you mated, or maybe if you didn't mean to mate them, so basically the parents, you when they're you should keep them. You need to keep them separated, because the mom could either get mad that the that the dad is there, which could hurt them, or the dad could hurt the babies when they're born. So she's in this, and she's taking out her fur still. And the boy, Honey, is currently in this big box, so it's nice and big for them. And like I said in my very first video, or second, um, that they need like a decent amount of space like this or something to walk around so they could exercise. But anyways, so here is him, Honey, and he's a boy. He's the dad. Honey, good boy, honey. So he's in here. He's more of like a lion head. He's really fluffy. She, actually, she is too, but yeah, he looks like a flat face. And she is a narrow face, like normal, I guess. And yeah, she's taking out her fur. And yeah. I'll update you guys tomorrow if she has her babies in the morning then well I'll just update you guys whenever she has her babies so yes have a great night and a great day tomorrow